Embark on a mystical escape with tonight's rainy sleep story, Stormy Night at Lookout Manor. In this cozy bedtime story for grown-ups, venture into a realm where time seems to stand still. As you arrive at a secluded cliffside manor, veiled in the lingering aura of the early 20th century, explore the idyllic grounds and navigate your way through an emerald green maze carved in hedges beneath the saturated pink and peach canvas of sunset you revel in the last of summer's embrace an incoming storm brings the cool reminder that autumn's touch is near you seek refuge in the embrace of a cozy library as a storm rolls in Wander through regal hallways adorned with oil paintings and candelabras. Their royal hues conjure thoughts of elegant eras gone by. Retire in your cozy suite, where the reverberating cascade of raindrops ushers you into the timeless comforts of sleep. It's time to dream away. Welcome to Michelle's Sanctuary. I am Michelle, your guide for the serene mental journey. Think of me as an old friend whose sole intention is to bring you the solace and tranquility you deserve. Before the story begins, I will lead you through a brief guided meditation, a gateway to slow your breath and clear your mind for the imaginative journey to come. Feel free to adjust any part of this practice to suit your preferences and tailor the experience to what resonates with you. Each listen will offer a unique encounter as your needs evolve naturally and are always changing No moment is ever the same. As you close your eyes, let the outside world fade away, replaced by the crisp mountain air that fills your senses. The support of your bed is beneath you. It offers safety and invites you to explore the uncharted terrains of your mind. Everything takes on a timeless quality, unfolding like a dream shaped by your imagination. Picture yourself ascending the winding roads that run among snow-capped mountains in the heart of summer, where peace is as abundant as the views that stretch before you. Take a moment to open your mouth and release a deep, audible sigh. Tension dissolves as your breath becomes like a gentle breeze sweeping through the valley. Inhale slowly through your nose, envisioning the invigorating mountain air carrying scents of pine wildflowers, and the freshness of the open air. Exhale through your mouth, letting go of the day's cares, and knowing each sigh draws you nearer to the threshold of slumber. Repeat this rhythmic breathing pattern twice more at your own pace. With each inhalation, Sense the calming essence of the mountain air as it infuses your being. At the top of these breaths, you may opt to yawn and enjoy the sense of surrender each yawn offers. And with each exhale, 
Feel your body settling deeper into your bed. Nestled in the sanctuary of your room and mind. In a place reserved for dreaming. Let your breath now find its natural rhythm. Offering a gentle reminder of the shift that has taken place within you. In this harmonious state, more at peace than moments ago, you realize how much may change in a moment. Indulge yourself in the backdrop of endless mountains and crisp summer air where time stands still and serenity reigns supreme. It's time for the story to begin. Your breath catches with curiosity when you think about the brave souls who brought the lookout manor to life at the turn of the 20th century. The golden age of train travel had commenced, opening the eyes of many to wonders that were experienced purely for leisure. Lookout Manor was one of many popular resorts, a beacon of success that came with this era of leisurely travel. You ascend the mountain in a vintage convertible offered by the resort to transport you to its summit. The driver is congenial yet formal, making occasional conversation as you wind your way through the sinuous roads that snake their way up the mountainside. The air grows purer with every mile, invigorating your senses and filling your lungs with a crisp vitality. The air also becomes thinner and you focus on each relaxing intake of air as you lean back into the cushioned seat. You look to the sky feeling the wind kiss your face, offering a sense of freedom. As you drive further up the mountain, the landscape transforms before your eyes, unfolding a panorama of verdant hues and wildflowers that paint the roadside in a kaleidoscope of colors. The cerulean sky stretches above you, a boundless expanse that seems to reflect a sense of endless possibilities. The road narrows into a stone driveway that wraps around gardens and mazes, a barn and a field of goats. As if guided by fate, you enter the grand wrought iron gates of Lookout Manor. The journey has brought you to this pinnacle, perched at the very edge of the world. The air carries the scents of pine and earth, and the slight minerality from a raging stream that circles the manicured grounds. The landscape is adorned with the vibrant flora of summer, thriving in the last weeks before an early frost will arrive. The car comes to a stop and the driver gets out to help you with your bags. His eyes sparkle in the sun, yet his demeanor remains stoic. You step onto the expansive grounds of the resort to be greeted by the smiles of staff members 
standing at the main doors. Despite the myriad of guests who like you have come for an escape from the stresses of daily living, there's an uncanny sense of quietude that envelops the space. The energy of the mountains where their awe-summoning presence make all the activity of humans seem small and inconsequential. Even at its most bustling times in summer, the retreat maintains an air of serenity. Lookout Manor, a stone masterpiece that reflects the influences of Gothic castles and English manors, stands as the sole dwelling for many miles. Staff members live on the property, exuding deep reverence and love for this magical place that has been maintained by generations of family before who also lived and worked here. Lookout Manor evokes a sense of timeless elegance. Its thick walls tell stories of ages past, bearing the weight of history like a well-worn tome. Intricate details and carvings draw your attention as every nook and edge of the facade were an opportunity for an artisan to showcase their talents. Your eyes travel from the delicate tracery of windows to the imposing grandeur of the main entrance. As you venture closer, you notice how the peaks of the stone manor emulate the jagged summits of the surrounding mountains, still adorned with a dusting of glistening snow, even at summer's end. The manor appears to have organically shot out of the very earth it graces. The stone facade wears its age with dignity. Each weather deviation is a marker of time, and all the castle has witnessed and survived. Elaborate multi-paned windows and French doors look out on the breathtaking vistas, and you see some guests leisurely basking in the sun behind the ornate iron rails of decks and Juliet balconies. The grandeur of the mountains mirrors the majesty of the manor, and you cannot help but feel humbled by the beauty that surrounds you. You enter the front doors and follow the blue and green carpet into the lobby as a staff member greets you and takes your bags, inviting you to explore the property as your room is prepared. You are handed a key with a scarlet tassel and a hand-carved wooden keychain that has been painted to replicate the manor and surrounding grounds. You place it in your pocket, eager to meander the property. You soon realize that your arrival at Lookout Manor is not just a destination, it's an immersion into a new world. The mountains offer a sense of protection, yet also a feeling of isolation and remoteness. 
and makes the happenings at the manor feel at times dreamlike. While your room is prepared, you explore the other side of the lobby. Every new corner unveiled reveals the designer's intention to reflect and honor the magnificence of the world outside. You step out into a courtyard and remember the words of your driver echoing in your mind. He described the unpredictability of storms that roll in with a ferocity that matches the mountain stature. Yet as you step onto an emerald knoll that unfolds like a grass carpet beneath your feet and look to the sky, there's no sign of rain. The world around you is a serene canvas of blues and greens. A path leads to the topiary garden, which brings to life otherworldly beings and animals. These hedges sculpt into intricate shapes, a cupid, an angel, an ethereal goddess bending down to feed small woodland creatures and powerful depictions of a mountain lion, a wolf, and a bear. These living creations guide your way with an air of mystique and lead you to a maze. At the entrance, two young children run circles around their mother, who smiles in your direction. Entering the maze, you're cocooned by the towering hedges that stretch toward the sky. Birds fly overhead, but beyond their melodic songs, the hedges muffle the sounds of the outside world. Golden sunlight filters through the leaves, casting playful shadows on the path ahead. You wind round and round, letting yourself get lost in the beauty and quietude. The faint trickling of water guide you to a marble fountain in the heart of the maze. Two goddesses in the center of the pool represent maternal love. Their slender fingers reach towards the mountain and sky. You pause and sit on the smooth stone bench that circles the turquoise water and watch sunlight refract in the mist. You feel a deep sense of serenity, as though you are exactly where you need to be right now. You navigate the labyrinthine passages as the sky transforms from rich, deep shades of blue to a palette of raspberry pink, peach, lavender, and gold. The sunset sky ignites the heavens as the descending sun casts the world in liquid gold. Every surface glistens as if kissed by stardust and you can almost feel the light dancing upon your skin, met by the breeze that rustles the tiny leaves of the hedges. Sensing it's time to find your way out before the sky darkens, you feel a familiar sensation, a soft, tug in your solar plexus. 
a trusted guide that has led you through uncertainty before. It's a beacon of intuition, an insistence that pulls you forward with purpose. With each turn you take, you follow this inner compass, weaving your way through the emerald maze. It feels good to trust yourself, a deep feeling of calm radiates through your body. In solitude, away from electronic devices and interferences, you connect with all the information your body gives you through your senses. As the sun inches behind the jagged mountain horizon, casting a golden glow upon the landscape, you step onto the manicured lawn once again and follow a stone path. The stones underfoot seem to absorb the honeyed light their surfaces reflecting the warmth of the day's final moments. You gaze back at the manor, and it's as if you're seeing it anew. Bathed in the silky, gilded glow of sunset, it stands as an ethereal presence against the dark silhouette of evergreen trees and mountain cliffs. But beyond the manor, you can see the landscape is shifting. The tranquil scene in the immediate vicinity is about to receive gray-bellied storm clouds that approach with a forceful wind. The contrast between brilliant gold and smoky gray seems to enhance the beauty of each. Anyone experienced with this region knows that every moment is as changeable as the weather and sky. As you approach another entrance to the manor, the shift in the atmosphere is palpable. The sky, once a canvas of warm hues, now darkens with the impending storm. The wind is cool, driving deeper into your muscles and bones than the afternoon sun, and inspiring a shiver. Yet knowing the comforts of the manor awake, you appreciate this excuse to get cozy and hunker down. The first fat drops of rain begin to fall, their percussion creating a delicate rhythm upon the sprawling property. Each drop seems to carry a note of anticipation of what's to soon arrive. Stepping inside the safe walls of the manor, the grandeur of the hall envelops you. The chandelier above, resplendent with crystal facets that catch the fading light, presides like a guardian over the heart of the hall. It hovers above a grand piano where a musician plays a beautiful melody that adds a haunting air of nostalgia as you immerse yourself in the music's embrace. Your gaze is drawn to the sepia-toned images that grace the walls. These captured moments 
offer glimpses into eras long gone and showcase the grand opening of the resort. Women in corseted dresses with parasols and men in linen suits stand frozen in time. Their expressions and postures speaking of a world that once was. The scenes whisper stories of grace and elegance, of dances in candlelit ballrooms, and conversations held in hushed tones. The lobby's air is an intoxicating blend of mountain freshness and a fragrance both familiar yet elusive. It's as if the sophisticated scent of a resort and the natural aromatics of camping intertwine, creating a rich experience. Mountain air mingles with hints of aged wood, polished stone, and the underlying sweetness of flowers and vases that are carried on the breeze, for the manor doors remain open as other guests scurry inside, escaping the increasing tempo of the unexpected falling rain. As the rain drums upon the windows, a server arrives, offering a tray of warm drinks to all guests. You take one, selecting something that happens to be your favorite beverage for rainy nights. You sip it slowly, savoring each sensory detail music, the visuals, the scents. The storm's approach adds a layer of drama and you find yourself in awe of the symphony that unfolds within the manor's walls. It combines to create an experience that transcends the present moment transporting you to a realm where the past and present intermingle. It's as if all moments spent in this manner through time are invited to come to light. Amid the corridors and chambers of the building, you're aware of the other guests who occupy the space. Each has embarked on their own journey, seeking solace just like you. Yet it's as though they exist in a realm parallel to your own. A collection of souls who share the same space, yet seem distant wrapped in their own narratives. It offers you a sense of feeling connected, while also relieved of any pressure to engage any more than you would like. You revel in getting lost in your own world. You wander down a corridor that leads to a library the walls are adorned with floor-to-ceiling shelves, each laden with volumes that hold the secrets and dreams of generations past. The air is heavy with the intoxicating scent of old books and the burning wood of a fire. In the heart of the library, grand fireplace offers warmth from the cool 
sharp air brought by the storm. It is unlike any fireplace you have encountered before. A hearth that seems to hold within its embrace the very essence of fire's magic. The flames dance with an enchanting rhythm as if they represent the heartbeat of the castle. The fires crackles and pops, intertwined with a patter of rain and the soft whispers of turning pages from guests nestled in nooks, reading around the space. Above the fireplace hangs an oil painting that consumes the whole wall above the mantel. It captures a lookout mountain of yesteryear on an autumn day. The colors are a rich blend of copper, gold, and orange, mirroring the hues of autumn leaves as they paint the landscape in what is the last season before the resort closes come winter. The painting stirs a sense of longing within you. A part of you yearns for the change in season, for the cool embrace of autumn's breath and the crunching of leaves beneath your feet. The image evokes memories not yet experienced, harvesting hopes of what may come when summer fades away. The autumnal scene invites you to lose yourself in its splendor, to imagine the crispness of the air, the enchantment of leaves falling on the earth, and the promise of transformation that only fall can bring. Your attention turns to the sprawling shelves of books that span from floor to ceiling over two stories high with ladders on rails that help one navigate the collection. Playfully, your fingers graze the worn spines until you pull a book at random. In a state of amusement, you tell yourself that whatever passage you discover will inform the night ahead. With a sense of curiosity, you open its pages and your eyes focus on a random sentence. Chance has led you to the words of Herman Melville, and they linger in the air like a promise from the past. But the mingled, mingling threads of life are woven by warp and woof, calms crossed by storms, a storm for every calm. Melville's words resonate with ancient wisdom. Closing the book, you're enveloped by the sweet, dusty scent of its pages. The dog-eared paper and its words once entertained guests who ventured here more than a century ago. And yet the writer's words still ring true. A reminder that life has always been woven with both calm and storm. As the storm rages outside, nature's fury becomes romantic in the refuge of the manor. You approach the windows I look onto the maze, 
watching as the rain pelts the topiary and the grass yields to the wind. A warm wave of gratitude flows through you as you deeply appreciate the comforts inside the library. But a sense of curiosity and the slow incoming tide of sleepiness inspire you to explore the manor, leaving the library's warmth behind. You venture out a hidden exit with an intentional desire to get lost within the manor's wings. You embark on a journey that winds through each passageway, each one showcasing a different royal hue, blue, scarlet, green, and gold. Every corridor reflects the themes of the suites that occupy them, some rustic with a pioneering spirit while others are opulent, paying tribute to the royals of the past. Candelabras line the walls and cast the corridors in a warm flickering light that dances across the plush carpet underfoot. The halls are alive with muffled conversations strains of music and the echoes of laughter that drift from guests settled comfortably within their suites. As you walk the cushioned embrace of the plush rug alters the way you step, inviting you to slow your pace and savor the elegance around you. You bask in the orange marmalade glow from the candelabra lights. Once lit by oil and now electric, their light continues to illuminate the manor's hallways, forging a link once again between the past and present. After dreamily walking through the captivating hues, you arrive at your suite's door. You remove the key from your pocket and unlock the latch. As you open the heavy doors, The space within welcomes you. The interior design replicates the grandeur of European castles. Tapestries grace the walls with stories told in intricate fabrics. Antique furniture made of rich cherry wood glistens in the dim lighting. Recently polished and tended to. The bed stands as a centerpiece, surrounded by a canopy of silks. Every detail has been carefully curated. An ode to a time when craftsmanship was revered and elegance was paramount. Every suite at Lookout Manor is a reflection of the resort's essence. A place where the glory of the past meets the comfort of the present. You step into the marble-clad bathroom and remove your shoes. The cool touch of the polished stone on the soles of your feet 
radiates through your legs. As you prepare for a moment of indulgence, you gather antique crystal vials of natural oils infused with local herbs, the essence of the mountainside captured in delicate drops. You fill the bathtub with warm water from a gleaming gold faucet and watch the drops descend into the water from an eyedropper. The aromas of mint and wildflowers fill the air and create a potion of relaxation. You settle into the bath. The peppermint causes your skin to slightly tingle you peer out the windows as rain cascades down the dozens of panes. Your head rests back on the wide, smooth rim of the tub. It cradles your neck perfectly and you close your eyes, inhaling the steam and sinking into the warmth tides of sleep come more frequently and you open your eyes feeling somewhere between reality and a dream. You slowly rise out of the water and dry off and then drape yourself in a luxurious bathrobe embroidered with a name, Lookout Manor, heavy, plush, and comforting like a maternal hug. You tie the belt around your waist and sigh. The fabric cocoons you in indulgence, a tactile reminder that within the manor walls, every detail is crafted to pamper and soothe. The rain outside continues its steady cadence and the winds howl around the stone walls. The sensation of invigorating freshness lingers on your skin bringing you back to the first moments atop the mountain when you arrived at Lookout Manor. You leave the bathroom to return to the bedroom, ready to let go of the day and fall asleep. You peel back the comforter and note your belongings have been carefully stowed on a luggage rack. You discover a note on the pillow, wishing you the perfect night of sleep. You turn off the light and sink into the bed's embrace. As you settle in, you once again think that Lookout Mountain it's not just a place. It's a realm that weaves dreams. With each breath, you feel the gentle pull of sleep. Your mind and body engage in a dance. As you waltz between wakefulness and slumber, like the graceful attendees of grand soirees hosted within the manor ballroom. These boundaries between wakefulness and sleep blur. A gradual surrender that leads you toward 
the inevitable comforts of sleep. The world beyond the manor fades away, and you're left with the faint sounds of your breath and the rain's constant serenade. You allow sleep to take the lead in this dance, slipping through the threshold that separates the realms of wakefulness and slumber. You give in to the dream-weaving magic of Lookout Manor, a haven where reality and dreams intertwine as you fade into a restorative, healing sleep. Finding bliss, finding rest, finding release, finding sleep. It's time to dream away.